guys. Welcome, Welcome. to the Christmas house, Buttery. <laughs> hey guys, so today is, what's it's, today? A special day for me. Why? Why you? Because I want to have a special day. What's happening? I'm going to be going to an other steak with nobody else. Girl, guys, today is a special day because guess who's coming? Who? Guess. Carissa? No. Kanta? No. Uh, Nanny? Ba uh, my baby sister? Yes, Kalia <laughs> is on her way. So guys, today is Sunday. Today is December 5th, and I'm getting induced today. I was due December 3rd, but clearly nothing happened. Nothing happened before, nothing happening now. So I'm going to the hospital tonight, and they're gonna induce me. Can, so, I, can I see the, can I see the cut the belly part? No. I don't wanna see the cut on the baby part cause I just wanna do the video. Girl, they're not gonna cut me. <laughs> Yes, well, hopefully they don't cut me. I, I'm staying calm. Good. <laughs> so, Cadence is going to be home with Grandma, right? Mm-hmm. And then I'm going to have a friend to play with. Aww. And then um, me and LeVar, we're going to the hospital, so... And then my little sister's going to have friends, like Kaylee. Mm-hmm. They're going to be hugging each other like goo-goo. Girl... So I'm excited. I'm nervous, but I'm excited because I've been pregnant since March, guys, and I am tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm tired. Wait, guess what? Guess who I told? Who you told? Daddy. You told him what? Baby coming. I want to sing a song for all of you. Okay, can you sing it after? I can't because we can do the. Let me just do this. Do what? To sing the song. Let me stop saying a word. And it's Christmas all day. And I watched uh, all day. And uh, all the things. Why are you still in your pajamas? <laughs> and all the things I do. And the things I do. I am a mother, you. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, guys. Hey. So, guys, I'm going to just put the camera right here. Yeah, I'll try to block it out. Try to block her out. So guys, um, everything is set. The car seat is in the car. Did you see the car seat? No. The car seat is in the car. The strollers, and just put the stroller in the car so that way when the baby does come, um, you know, I don't have to worry about having to put it in the car. It'll already be in my trunk. And, and for those of you who do not know, I did get a new car. Lavar bought me um, a car as a push gift, so I have a brand new SUV. That's what we got going on here this morning. Um, we went ahead and decorated the tree, right? With me. So and we look did, at the tree. Look at so the let me tree. We did a peppermint tree this year. Let me zoom in. I'm on the couch, guys, because I'm tired. So we did a peppermint tree. We're going to light it up. It'll be lit up later on today. But it's super cute. Stop. It's super cute. It's um red, white, and gold. And then here... Dun, dun, dun. We have my hospital bag and we also have the baby's diaper bag. So we're pretty much ready to go um, tonight. Right. So before um, I do go, I'm relaxing right now, but I do have like a few things to do. I gotta go pay her school tuition. We gotta go um, pick up some trash bags that I ordered. Yes, I'm still ordering things even on the day that I'm Look, giving birth. I have a baby too. Girl move Get laughter. <laughs> so that's what's going on guys and yeah and this is our video and 
hit the subscribe button. Hit the hit the Christmas tree music bell and ornament trees all the ground. Okay, thank down you. Everywhere. Guys. Alright guys, so I just wanted to give you guys a quick update. I'm actually about to eat a little bit and then I'm gonna head to the hospital. So they did tell me, I'm making sure there's food in there. They told me that um, they're ready for me so they wanted me to eat and then come in. So that's what I'm about to do. LeVar is outside doing something, I don't know what he's doing. My mom is getting Caden's ready for bed and yeah. I'm nervous, but I'm ready to get this over with. Like, I'm tired, guys. I'm really, really tired. All right, so guys, we're on our way to the hospital. What, me? My bag is here. I got my toiletries here. It didn't fit in my what, little bag. What, and look what I did. What? You know what's outside. What? My paper. Yeah, she wrote a letter to her teacher. So next time you see me, we're going to have a baby. Here. She gonna have a flat stomach. And then you can pick me up. No, I won't be able to pick you up for six weeks. What? I just have. What? what? I cannot wait for you. All right, so guys, we're headed to the hospital, and yeah. Wish I'm, me so, can I'm go so nervous. You? I don't know why. I'm so. Can nervous. I go with you? Can I go with you? And Grandma, take me back. Please? No, they don't let kids in the hospital. Wow, I want to see the cute, adorable babies in the baby room. All right, guys, so we're pulling up to the hospital. We're a little late. We're like 30 minutes late. So we got to go through the emergency department. This is her being spoiled, doing a little shopping in her hospital bed. Let's move that away. Anything you want to say? So, guys, we just checked in. We checked in at 8.50. They took my weight, my vitals. They had me change. So I'm wearing the hospital gown for now, but I'm going to change into my personal gown. And, um, you know, they got to ask us like a whole bunch of questions. I got my IV. Mm -hmm. And right now, um, I'm one centimeter dilated. And what did she say? She's talking to my doctor to find out what the next steps are because... Um, when they originally checked me, I wasn't dilated at all. So they have to find out what the doctor wants to do. Um, so yeah, we're just waiting so far. So good. So far, so good. No pain, no nothing. So I am having contractions, but I guess I, I'm, I'm not feeling them. But they have me like on the monitor thing. Let me show you guys. Woo woo. They have me like on the monitor thing so they can time and see like when my contractions are coming. So we're just hanging out waiting and LeVar's going to find out if I could have a snack. I don't know where she's going to get that snack from. Like from a vending meal. I really want like a Twix or something. You don't need any candy. So yeah, just to give you guys an update, that's what's going on. So I'm... Um, really nervous my mom isn't here i think that's what's making me more nervous but because last time her mom was here guys yeah last time my mom was here and um but because of covid they uh it's only one visitor yeah because of covid it. only lavar can be here and i mean unless you want her here and i can be with cadence you want to do that no no <laughs> all right guys so we'll catch you guys back up in a little bit 
All right, guys. So we're. <sighs> coming now. They just gave me medication, and now I'm having contractions. But they're like, they're not too bad. I'm getting them like every seven to ten minutes. Um, Lavar's on hold with Grubhub because you want to tell them what happened. So somebody used my card um, up in Atlanta for some food. So I'm on trying to make sure that um, they're not able to hopefully get that food and cancel that order. Yeah. Scammers, scammers, scammers. Scammers beware. Tis the season. I know, but that's messed mm -hmm. up that they would do that. Yeah, I know. All right, guys. So this girl is knocked out per usual. You know, she's always sleeping. Um, but this is my little um, cot that I'm going to be sleeping on tonight. So um, if it's not too too much, I might show you guys like, like the final layout of this thing. But um, I'm about to call it a night, um, get some rest because this is probably... I'm about to uh, call it a night, get some rest. This is probably the last night that I might be sleeping for some time. So, um, I'm gonna try to enjoy it while I can. Alright. How are you? So, they, um, the doctor came in, he broke my water, and now the contractions are like more intense and they're becoming more, um, like closer together so I'm just trying to breathe through them um, I didn't get an epidural yet but I don't know why she waiting I'm pretty sure I'll need one mm -hmm. and I'm about to have a contraction hold on here we go you're probably traumatizing a lot of people right about now <sighs> like a four and I've gone like up to a seven already we've been at a 12 well it says that but it doesn't feel that way right. once my doctor broke my water the contractions were like a little bit more, more tense yeah like they hurt more so it is <clears throat> 8 30 so around the water was broke at us uh, 7.55 so at 10.30 they're going to start me on they're going to check me again and then they'll start me on the Pitocin and then um, kind of speeds up the process so if you guys don't know <sighs> let me show them so this monitor right here let me see if I can zoom in the one all the way at the bottom that lets you know when she's going to have a contraction, it'll spike up. And then when she's not having the contraction or it's going down, you'll see it, you know, going downhill to kind of show you. And the machine can, like, pick it up. <clears throat> Excuse me. The machine can pick up when she's going to have a, a contraction uh, before she even knows it. So. Yeah. So, he's got, they're going to leave me the Pitocin. If you guys don't know, the Pitocin are, like, the fake contractions. So, it's just, like makes your body contract even more to speed things up so i don't know we'll see what happens i'm like super hungry I, all i had last i ate dinner last night but then I, when i got here i was hungry again they gave me some jello and now all i can have is just some water so you're doing good halfway there yeah yeah so I'm nervous, but I'm trying my best to like keep your remain, composure. Yeah, calm. So yeah. I'm breathing through the contractions, and hopefully, I don't know. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna end up needing the epidural, but we'll see. Yeah, I told you should have got it out the way. But let's, if you wanna wait, that's fine. I will wait. Yep, you're the master in this room, so. Do what you need to, what you feel is best, okay? All right, love you. Love you too.
Nah, you don't love me. I don't love you either. Move. 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 All right, guys. All right. I'm going to give them an update. Can, they, can you see me? Uh, yeah. Okay, guys. So, as you can see, I'm in my... Um, my little pink and white <laughs> hospital gown. Um, I ended up getting the epidural. She has a little ball here. Yeah, so um, the pain was just coming, to, the contractions were coming too quick. And I like was trying to breathe in between them and it just wasn't working. So I ended up getting the epidural and now they just started me on Pitocin. Um, so now we're just, we're about two centimeters, so we're waiting for my cervix to finish opening up, so that way I can start pushing. So like the first four to five centimeters is like the longest to get to, but once you hit like that fifth centimeter, uh, it goes pretty much fast, uh, from there. Yeah, I remember with Cadence, um, it took me forever to get to four centimeters, I think like, um, I want to say like 10 hours or something like that. And yeah, then 10, 11 hours. Literally like in the last hour, I went from like a 4 to a 10. So, you know. 0 to 100 real quick. Right. So anything is possible. So, you know, we're just, I will, me personally, I'm just like anxious, ready to get over with mm -hmm. because. I can't wait to see her face. I'm tired. I'm like really, really tired. Yeah. The epidural is like making me really sleep. Whatever medication it is, it's making me sleepy. Yeah. But so. you're doing a good job, man. Just, you, you're almost there. Yeah. So they just gave me some jello and I ate it like, like that because I'm starving. Yeah. More. More. <laughs> and LeVar had Chick fil A. I didn't eat in front of you, though. Like, I get cool points for that. But I, I was hungry. I didn't eat anything last night. So I'm just checking my blood pressure. Alright, so I just wanted to give you guys a quick update. I'm going to take a quick nap. And, yeah. Ready to go, night-night? Alright. <laughs> Alright, guys. Alright. Alright, guys. So I am at... It's 6... 6 to 7. 6 to 7. With the contraction. Yeah, 6 to 7. Um... Centimeters. Centimeters. So, um, they already started prepping the room for baby. Ooh, so ooh. For surgery. And I'm so nervous. I'm shaking. I don't know. I'm like really, really nervous. But I'm trying to like calm down because anything I do affects the baby. Mm hmm. So don't want to be stressed. I just to give you guys like a quick update on what's going on. So probably in like two hours, maybe three, the most, um, she'll be here. So I think within the next two hours, within. So yeah, they were supposed to bring me some soup, but I guess that no, won't be happening now. So yeah, guys. Um, the pain level is at about a one or two. Um, they did give the epidural, but it's, it, I'm not numb and I can still feel some contractions, just not like the really, really bad ones. So, right. So that's good. Yeah. So that's what's going on. And yeah, we're just waiting. All right. I'm coming, baby. Guess who's here? Kalia. Yeah, you been stubborn? Huh? Oh, it's just beginning. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Kalia, thank you so much. Kalia, you been stubborn, girl? Hmm? Daddy's right here. I'm here, you know that? You hungry, mama? Yeah, what you grabbing on to? What you grabbing on to? Yeah, it's okay. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah, she did that to you. Yeah. Who, mommy? Yeah. Huh? Where? Yep. Right behind you, okay? Yep. How much you weigh, mama? Hey. Oh my God, look at you. I'm gonna sneak right past you. Oh, no. Oh, sorry. It's okay, you're gonna go to mama, go lay your mama. Yeah. Let's go, oh, mommy. Let's go lay on mommy. You want mommy. Let's go lay. <laughs> He's okay. Mm -hmm. You covered up. You're gagging, so, you know. Yeah, exactly. So she's nice and warm. <laughs> look at that oh. face. <laughs> oh, look at you. Look at you guys. Wow. The Howard Squad is now four. Huh? Take a picture. I am. The long way. The long way? Okay, hold on. Yeah. Okay, mama. Look at you. Yeah, that's mommy. That's mommy. Okay. She can't eat yet because she's breathing um, pretty fast. And I just want to make sure that she didn't swallow any of the amniotic fluid. Amniotic fluid. And plus the fluid um, while she was in the placenta, she pooped. So... Um, you know, we want to make sure she didn't inhale it or anything like that. So we got to wait probably like an hour or two for her to eat. Yeah. I just gave her the pacifier, guys. So She was sucking her thumb. And that's a habit. Let me tell you guys something. As soon as you see it, nip it in the butt. Mm -hmm. So I gave her a pacifier because that's harder to wean than sucking a finger. So she's really... No, it's, it's easier to wean off of a pacifier yes, than yeah, sucking, a finger. sucking a thumb. And I know, because I used to suck on my thumb when you I was did. a baby. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So um, she's really tired. I'm really tired. The birth was, she kept going in and out, in and out. So um, it, it was a little traumatic for her. Well, birth in Exhausting itself is for her and for me because it was hard for me to push while being numb. So, yeah, you know, we're just recovering. They're monitoring me. Yeah. Yep. Look at the wild gazelle in the Aussie. Look how she devours her prey. They're so annoying. With no second chances, she makes sure. I am when she's done. With no second chances, she makes sure that the meal is done. I will punch you, stop. She's even violent when she's eating, so you have to be careful not to upset her. Oh man, that's a thing of beauty. Alright guys, so baby's finally here. Um, ah, man. Like the hour, that hour, like that final hour is just so nerve wracking. Um, you know, trying to calm her down, get her to push, all of that good stuff. But um, she did a good job. She was finally able to do it. And Kalia, baby Kalia is finally here. I don't know if I can get you guys. There you go. She's right over there. Look at that. She did good, man. I'm happy. Um, now we're just going to spend some time, take some pictures and stuff. And uh, just make sure she's okay, you know, now that she's here in this world. All right, guys, we will keep you posted.